This is my new Rubin X3, and I got this last week, so I decided to take it on a camping trip and got some amazing results. I've reviewed a lot of flashlights, and this one is by far the best, what I call the all-in-one all -in solution uh, for lighting, whether you're camping or even using it at home. Here we are up close. Now, this product was a gift that was sent to me by the company, but I chose this because, again, all-in-one lighting system. It has so much built into it, and the technology is just amazing for only weighing 70 grams. Okay, so this is 50 lumens, and double-click, 700 lumens. So that's pretty bright. Hold it down for the red, and that's red uh, 80 lumens. Let me go over everything that comes with it before I kind of dive into the features of it. But uh, you get the flashlight, which is a 360 rotating head. So you can see right here, you can hold it to where it goes forward and turn it this way to where it can just stand up and light up. Then you have your charge case, which when you put the uh, flashlight into it, it becomes a lantern. So I'll, I'll show you that in a little bit. And then you have a, a charge cable, which is also kind of like a little lanyard. So it, it all goes together like this. And it goes into a lanyard so if you need to charge your phone you have a USB-C and then there's a little adapter right here that pops out for a lightning port so that's really cool that all that comes with it and uh, you also have your manual now like most of the new technology and flashlights today you have uh, a single button that has multiple operations the first feature I wanted to go over was the wireless charging this is by far one of the coolest because everything now kind of does wireless charging and sometimes you don't want to you know pull out a cord and so all you do is you can see this battery bank here it has a dock so I'm going to turn it on and then place the flashlight on it and it might take a second to find the spot you can see it's green and we're charging so you can see right there I can just leave this right here and it'll sit and it'll charge for me and I won't have to worry you know about having to use the dock I can charge it like that if maybe I don't have this with me I know sometimes it can be quite a task to learn the different buttons but nowadays with everything having one or two buttons that do multiple functions it's pretty easy to get the hang of and if you're not sure you can just click once click twice long click you know just kind of go through it and uh, experiment with uh, you know how it works but I'll go over all that and the different uh, how to get the different lights and the different modes in a second real quick I wanted to note the packaging I've gotten a lot of flashlights that they really don't think about packaging and it just comes bare and so I thought this was a real cool package it has all of the uh, the lumens on the back so it shows each mode and kind of the lumens you know the max turbo mode being 700 and uh, your red light actually has two modes, so it's not just a red light, you're gonna get 30 lumens. Well, it really comes out at 80 lumens and one lumen, so that's really cool. Now onto the different instructions on how to use it. As you can see, this chart here sometimes can be a little daunting, but it's really easy to use. Again, I didn't go over this when I first got it. I just kind of was clicking through to uh, learn it on my own, and it, it's very intuitive. So features of the actual light, wireless charging pad, this is magnets on the bottom, it's magnetic, so you can hang it while you're working on something. That's a really cool feature. The fact that it has the swivel head, so you can have light either this way, or if you turn the head, you can see, you can use it like a normal light, so that's really cool. On the back side, you're gonna have your clip, so if you have it like this, you can hang it on your backpack, and while you're walking, it's just gonna you know, follow wherever you are from uh, wherever strap that you hook it to on your pack. Uh, the but single button up here LED screen so if you hit the button you can see it's showing the battery life the lumens and it's saying level three so if I double tap that it'll go up that's turbo mode 700 lumens oh, and if you single tap it'll always kind of go back to either the level three level one level two so I've long, long pressing it is going to go between the smaller lumens and if you double tap that's going to go into turbo mode then uh, to get into the red light, if we hold it down when it's off, there's your red light, hold it down, it'll change levels, that's level one. And then you got level two, which is your 80 lumen red light, so that's pretty good red light. And then if we single tap, it'll go back into the white light. And so it kind of holds that white light mode unless you hold it down, it'll always go back to the red and it'll hold that mode too. So another great feature on the Wubin lights, I have this same feature on the XO, is when you tap it four times, one, two, three, four, it actually goes into lock mode. You see it's locked. So if you drop it, tap it in your bag, it's not going to turn on. You got to do that four tap to unlock it, one, two, three, four. And it's cool that it shows you that lock so you know, hey, it's locked. Uh, but, you know, tap it again, it turns on into that one, hold it down, and get into different modes. And so it'll kind of keep that 
that mode that it turned off on. Now here is the actual charging case, which also doubles as a lantern. I use this a lot whenever I was sitting at the table at night or I just wanted just a, a small lantern that would light up the table where I was sitting. And uh, all you do is open it up, turn the light on, set it in the charger, and it'll charge uh, from the case while it's on. So you see it's charging, but we have it on and it'll actually, you know, just illuminate uh, the table. And so if you tap it, it'll actually turn on while it's charging. You hold it down, it'll go through the, some of the lower modes. It won't go into the turbo mode while it's like this, uh, but you can get the lower light modes and be able to use them um, however you want while it's in the case. Another cool thing about the charging case is we can charge other devices. So if you open the little flap here and we plug in our charging cable, you can see we'll charge uh, the Samsung. So we just plug it in, USB-C to C, and then it'll start to charge. If you have an iPhone, it'll, you know, you just use this little adapter and you can use the lightning port for iPhone. But that's really cool that you can charge your other devices from it as well as, you know, charge the case. So just another great feature that uh, I've never seen in like a flashlight system. Now this is your normal configuration when you're traveling or this is the one that I use. So I just put the lanyard on the back of the charging case and it stays there. So if you need anything, it's just all in one. Uh, I'm just blown away by this lighting solution, like the fact that uh, everything it does and the fact that if I don't have my case, you know, I was worried like not having the case, like what am I gonna do to charge it, that I can wire, wirelessly charge it with a, a wireless dock. It just makes it more simplistic to be able to, you know, not worry about not having a cable or not having the actual case. And with the bigger flashlights, most of them now have where you can charge it on the flashlight, but for the size of this light, you know, uh, this is one of the best and most features packed into a small light of its size that I've come across. So uh, they definitely did a great job. This is the Rubin X3 and uh, I, I loved using it while I was camping this weekend and I look forward to using it more in the future.